What's going on YouTube? Dave here, long time no talk. Uh, wanted to give you a, a quick video, quick channel update, um, and give you some reasons behind why I haven't posted in, in a few days. So um, actually, I've been pretty much super sick since I uh, posted my last video on Tuesday night. And then I was traveling for work on Wednesday, so I was traveling sick. And by the time I got home Thursday morning, I was pretty much dead to the world. So that's one of the reasons why it's been quiet the last few days, why I haven't replied back to comments. It's also the reason why there's no background. Um, I had a quick burst of energy to make this video, uh, but not really enough to go dig through a bunch of cards and stuff. So a um, few things for you guys. First off, when I was traveling um, on Wednesday, I know I don't do a ton of baseball, but I had some time to kill before my flight. I stopped by a card shop and uh, was talking to the guy. Their prices were pretty high, but they had really good prices on the Bowman Chrome HTA. And normally I wouldn't, you know, pay that much for baseball. But, uh, you know, like I said, they're actually cheaper than what my LCS here was selling them for, per their Instagram. And I'd ask them if they had hit any monsters, and he said out of like three, four box, no color at all. So I figured, hey, what the heck, it's probably, uh, probably worth a shot. So I ended up buying a box. I actually ended up ripping it there because um, <laughs> I knew I probably would have ended up ripping it at the airport without um, any um, one touches or um, anything like, like that. But uh, anyways, I'll recap that here in just a second, what I pulled. Um, looking forward here over the course of the next couple weeks, like I said, I've been out of commission. I've pretty much been in bed since Thursday and it's Sunday afternoon right now. Um, so coming up here over the course of the next couple weeks, I'm actually going to do a series um, of all my my national boxes. Um, so I think about like six or seven boxes at the national. Of course, I ripped them all back in August because I couldn't sit and wait on them. Um, but I've actually been saving them for a time like this. I probably won't rip anything new unless I start feeling really better, but I still want to be able to bring that energy and fire. And uh, it'll just be easier to give you guys some of those and um, recover 100%. So um, you'll see my boxes from the Nationals. If there's some older comments, again, remember they they were filmed back in, in August. So um, let's see. I think that was the, the two biggest things. So here is the order. These are actually were in the box. And what's funny is I opened them backwards because uh, I saw the redemption and I was thinking, oh, that is going to be a monster. So our redemption ended up being uh, Micker Adolfo. Um, again, I'm not a huge baseball guy. I know some folks like baseball um, a lot, wanted to see more in the channel. Um, but I think this was like a, a $30, it's just the base um, auto. So ended on a, uh, hoping it was something, something major. But the middle card was, Brendan Little, and that's numbered 5 of 150, uh, prospect for the Cubs. What's up, Sunday? She's back there playing with her toy, going crazy. Um, I feel very bad for her. I haven't given her much attention the last handful of days, but um, I think some comps I've checked today, this was like a $50 card, so, um, you know, nice chunk of change. The first color that they had seen out of anything that they'd pulled so far. And then the last card, which is actually the first card that I, I flipped, um, like I said, I went backwards, and uh, this is a this is quite a doozy here. It's not an Akuna or an Otani, but this is a Carter Keyboom for the Kaboom um, on card. The what is it? The Orange Wave. I don't remember what it's called, but eighteen to twenty-five. Now that Soto's up in the majors, he was named the. Uh, He's the Nats' top prospect. He was a minor league player of the year. I believe I've seen some um, some rankings where he's uh, the number 10 prospect in all of baseball. So this one ended up being a nice, pretty penny. I do have it up for sale on eBay um, and uh, am taking offers on it. So if you are interested in Carter Key Boom, shoot me an email. Uh, hit me up on Instagram. Or again, you can offer through eBay, but obviously I prefer to sell off eBay. Uh, just so then less fees to deal with. So with that, again, thank you all for supporting the channel. 
Um, after this, I will be uploading a, a box of XR that I ripped on Tuesday night. Uh, really to make sure that you, you football folks have something and I'm not uploading two straight boxes of, of baseball for you. But as always, like, subscribe, tell a friend, and we'll catch you next time. See ya.